Hello, everybody. Today it was a secret. You don't know what it is. You're going to get a surprise today because you've been an especially good boy all week. Do you know what it is? No. No, you don't. Put your hands out. Close your eyes. A gander, dark hound. Did we see this today? Yes. When we were watching Gundam? Yes. It's so dark. It's quite a few colours, I thought. So there's white, red, yellow, there's three, black, four colours. Oh, no, gray. no green. Two shades of grey. Not bad. It looks very similar to the Age 2, and in fact, if we look at the box, look, it says Gundam... Age 2. Yeah, Age 2 Dark Hound. How much did it cost? Retails for 700 yen. It was released in... What month is it now? Is it June 2012? It has a little boxy thing, doesn't it? Number 21 in the series of advanced grades something strange can you see something do you notice something missing a card yes that's right there's no card since when did they stop giving cards out that's a bit disappointing isn't it because we collect the cards can we show should we show everybody how many cards we've got now show everyone how many cards we've received Look at all these! Lots of duplicates even. Look at these! Lots and lots of cards. Double bullets, tortoise, sparrow, and... So what are these Pokemon cards doing in here? Look at all the cards we've received. Thanks everyone. And and who's that? Azimo and, and he turned into a birdie. I'm not sure. At the end, he did explain why he turned into a pirate. We like the pirate. Maybe. He has a lance, doesn't he? And here, look. He has pirate hooks. Let's make him now. Let me take a few what elements. Is that? It fires out the hooks and it can electrocute the its enemies on big wires. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Yes. You don't sound that excited about it. Were you expecting something else for your surprise? Yes. What were you expecting? You said you wanted the dragon one. You wanted the dragon one? Oh. Maybe next time. The big green dragon one. That's right. We'll Daddy, Daddy, we don't like the fat one. Because it's a bit like a lump of thing. <laughs> right, let's get going. What's that thing? It's a big weapon. It's a big pointy thing that you can use to spike vegans. Let's see what... If we make it... If we make the Gunda, we will know what is it. We will know what it... Oops. I'll pause the video. Explain what you think that is. I think that one is the... I think it goes on his chest. And it shoots something out. Something out on on the age three, I think. What? This is the same frame that we had for the H two double bullet, isn't it? So he has an A hiding underneath his um, skull and crossbones face. Um, I'm going to put that out. Put the chest piece and then there's a D1. D1, here, another black piece. That part goes there. No, that goes last. Push that bit in there. That bit goes last. Put that one in. This red piece goes on the back. You done it? 
No, you see. All these extra parts. Oh, that's cool. That's his gun. Oh, he can just. Hey, will that go in the chest? Now he could transform. I don't think this one can transform. We're expecting a bit too much from an advanced grade. It's only 700 yen. Oops, 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 oops. Like that. Can I do the head? Oh! Oh, the face is the wrong colour. Is this meant to be... I think it's meant to be a light grey colour. And this one's all black. Ooh. And it does have an eye patch, but I have to paint it green. Oh well. Where does that go on? Where's his arms? Where is the head arm? Oops. That's funny. Yes, it is. So where is yeah. the... This oh, pink goes on his back. And then there's this piece. Daddy, and then this piece goes in front. It can't go in here. Yes, it doesn't transform this one. Because if it transformed, this head would pop in, wouldn't it? Yeah. Now I should make the head. Oh, and you can put the skull in now. And then the front of his trousers. Oh! You ready? Almost done, Mum. Good job. This bit, I think that should go in there somehow. Talk. He has two guns down. Two? Yes. One another gun. Maybe they are guns. Oh, he's handling hooks. You can hold them like guns. Or can they go on his wings? Well done. Yay, I know. What about oh, put his that? legs on. Put his legs on. Then he can shoot the hook out. That'd be cool. And he's a pirate Gundam. I think he needs a parrot on his shoulder, doesn't he? Maybe he needs one leg. Is he good? Thumbs up, thumbs down? Thumbs up. And we don't need that. And then stop that then. And we'll just do like that. It's a little bit transformed, isn't it? Maybe if we took his legs over, it would be better. Hey! Okay, I have an idea that if I snap his spine here, I might be able to get all the parts to still interlock together and allow him to transform. This is going to be an experiment. What is what this experiment? It's something we're going to try. Hey, we go! This will be cool. Tell me if anybody's tried this already. So, Danny's going to take some rather rudimentary clippers here. I think if I snap it above here, there are still enough interlocking areas to allow it to still hold together. There you go. Okay, so that's gone. Oh, let's use glue. No, we don't need glue. Let's see if we can still put it together. If we can't, that means we've broken it. <laughs> or Daddy has anyway. Yes! Then, and then And you... still be strong enough to stand up. Good. So we'll try 
little tab here and there's a slot on his back and they do look as if they might go together if I shave this piece off here. Let's give it a go. Might just work. Bit of a tenuous connection, but da da da. You transformed I think, it. I think that's a hidden feature in this advanced grade. And back into mobile suit mode. And he's rock steady. That's pretty cool. Double thumbs up. <laughs>